And here's another yakitori. If you can't handle spicy foods, just eat this one. We even get a plate. And here's the red golden tray. This looks really fancy. Which eraser looks the most delicious? I'm going with that dessert one. Time to open up some sushi. Here's a piece of delicious salmon. If it's too much rice, you can peel the fish off. Here's a piece of red tuna. Yummy! Ooh! And here's some delicious unagi. This is one of my favorites. You can call this tamago, or sweet egg. We'll call this one squid. And here's salmon roe. and we could place all of our sushis onto this tray. Order up! Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon! If you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we're bringing you Iwako, Japanese Puzzle Eraser. These are shaped like drinks, snacks, and desserts, so I can't wait to show you guys! Let's start with the dessert erasers. I'm gonna say this dessert is a chocolate banana with whipped cream and some strawberries. You could even take this dessert piece off the cup. Here's a delicious looking muffin with some lime frosting. You can remove three pieces with this one. Here's a yummy looking crepe. It's got some strawberry bananas and whipped cream. Give this video a thumbs up if you're a fan of crepes. And here's a chocolate biscuit sandwich. It's got a bunch of frosting in the middle. You can separate all this if you like. Here's a beautiful looking cake with some strawberries on top. It looks so classy! And here's a tasty roll cake. It looks like it has some strawberry filling.
you can place all your desserts on this tray. These all look so real! I keep forgetting they're erasers! Which one do you guys like the best? Now let's check out these snacks that you can find at a mini mart! Here's a canned drink! Oh, nice! You could take the top off! Here are some instant noodles! Just pour some hot water and you're ready to eat! We get a different type of instant noodles. If you're hungry, eat this one. Here's some candy, or it even looks like chips. What do you guys think? These are crackers! Oh! It looks like someone ate them all! Here's some orange juice to wash down all our snacks! And we get another beverage in the bottle! Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we're bringing you heart, Shin Chan Chicken Drink. You probably just went, what? It's pretty much a Japanese experimental candy drink. Here's the mixing packets and a straw. This is our science lab tube. It also acts as a cup. And if you look at the back, we fill the water up to this line. So I'll go ahead and do that. The instructions say to pour in this purple packet first. We created a purple liquid! Give it a little stir... Now let's pour in this red packet! It should fizz up and change color! Awesome! We just changed the color from purple to red! I feel like a mad scientist! Ooh! And we can see it bubbling up! After a while, you'll notice it getting fizzy. And our drink is complete! It's cool and simple, right? Now it's the moment of truth! Let's see how it tastes! Mmm! <sighs> I know the color is red! But it tastes like orange soda! It's pretty good! I'm a fan of this drink! Well, this was a lot of fun! Thanks for watching! Please subscribe to watch more! See you soon! Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter! 
The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we'll be having some more fun with toilets again. I got three do-it-yourself Japanese toilet candies. I can't wait to see how this works. If you look at the top of the box, there's a rectangle right here that indicates what color the toilet is. So the first one was blue, this one's pink, and the last one is green. I feel like this is the Japanese version of Inside Out. Each toilet character has different personalities. Let's open it up! Here's the sticker to decorate the toilet. We get two flavors. Here's cider. And this is cola. We even get a straw. Here's our toilet seat. This is the toilet tank. A lid for the seat. And here's a lid for the tank. Before we begin, let me assemble this really quickly. Remember to close the lid when you're done using the toilet. This toilet's so clear. I don't know how I feel about using a clear toilet in real life. And for the final touches, we'll decorate the toilet. Those are some cool glasses. This toilet's got some fierce looking eyebrows. How perfect! This toilet actually matches disgust from inside out. The Just like how we see Joy in the beginning of the movie, our first figure is Joy too. What a coincidence! Joy's job is to make Riley really happy. Time to move on to the next one. Here's Disgust crossing her arms. She basically keeps Riley from being poisoned, physically and socially. Also, appearances matter for her. Let's see who's in this one. We got disgust again, but she's actually doing something different with her arms. This figure is pretty much saying, don't come near me. And this disgust says, I don't care. Let's open up some more. Awesome! We got Joy again. She's holding a memory orb this time. When Riley gets happy memories, she gets a yellow orb. 
And this is how Joy feels every time a yellow memory orb comes in. Pure happiness! Alright, let's keep going! Here is Rainbow Unicorn. She lives in Riley's mind at Dream Productions. I guess you can call her a dream star. Oh, and Joy's a big fan of hers. This is so much fun! Here's Bing Bong! He was one of my favorite characters. If you guys watch the movie, you know that when he cries, he cries out candy. So far, all our figures have been different. This is sadness! Give this video a thumbs up if you're a fan of sadness! Here's Anger! Anger makes me laugh, and when he has flames on his head, you know he's super angry! Here's Fear! Fear is good at keeping Riley really safe! I'm pretty excited we still haven't found duplicates! Here's Sadness laying down. She acts like this when she's really sad. Come on Sadness, we have to go back to headquarters to save Riley! Uh oh, it looks like she's too sad to move. Let's see what's in this one. We found anger again, but he's not as angry as before. He cares very deeply about things being fair. You want to make sure you keep anger here, and not here. Let's open up our last mystery minis for today. Nice! We found all 12 different characters! Here's Bing Bong when he's not crying. Looking at him makes me sad. I think if you buy the whole Mystery Minis box, you get all 12 characters. 
Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Marvel Superhero Mashers. We'll be playing with Iron Man Hotshot Hot Rod. I'm a big fan of Marvel, what about you guys? And here's the back of the box. Look at all the funky things we can do with the Superhero Mashers. We can mix and match pieces of all these Superhero Mashers. Unfortunately, all these pieces don't come in the set. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here's Iron Man, or at least part of him. Here's his hand, his leg, here's his really cool motorcycle. And this is Iron Man's weapon. We'll assemble Iron Man first. Now he has both arms. So it seems like this Iron Man's pretty functional. We can move all of his arms, twist his head, and we can move his legs. I almost forgot. We have to put his other leg on. Now let's take a closer look at the bike. The wheels run really nicely. Cool, it could also stand on its own. And you could pull out the handlebars like this. And this bike comes with cool designs matching Iron Man's outfit. And here are the headlights. I really want a bike like this. I'm definitely not cool enough to ride this, so we'll have Iron Man ride it. If I was a villain, I would never want to go up against Iron Man. He looks too intimidating. And here's Iron Man's weapon. You could press the top button to shoot it. Let's see how Iron Man looks when he holds his weapon. That's super cool! You can also place the weapon on the side of his motorcycle. You can even move it around. Such a lovely day. You know, I could really go for a biscuit. Golly, what was that? He was going way too fast. No worries, Chase is on the case. Please pull over to the side. Now let's see what this is all about. Bigger than I thought he would be. If, if, uh, um, 
Mr. Big Red Guy, um, you're, you're going, you're going a little too fast. Can you just be a little slower, please? That would just be a lot safer for everyone, you know? Just, yeah. You got it, little pup. But now I'm off to fight some real crime. <laughs> real crime? Whoop. Then what am I doing? I'm fighting real crime too, sir! Real crime. Well, this was a lot of fun! Thanks for watching! Please subscribe to watch more! See you soon! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we're bringing you some more Iwako Japanese Puzzle Erasers! This time we got some sushi and soup ones! Remember, they may look really real, but they're just erasers! Let's start by opening up this one! This looks like some dessert dish! It has some vanilla ice cream, strawberries, and mint! You can take the dessert out of the bowl. And this looks like a rice dish. I think there's some eggs and egg yolk in there. It looks like a face. We get a spoon. Here's some green tea. It comes in this really pretty teacup. Careful, it's hot. Here's a green yakitori. I think this one's spicy. It has a lot of wasabi on it. A ladybug. Alright, now it's time to make some candy. I'll use the cider flavor. Put in two scoops of water using the tank lid. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward this part so that we can see it much more quickly. Whoa, look! Awesome! Our toilet bowl's filling up! I think we may need a plunger soon. Maybe I should close the lid for now. Somebody used too much toilet paper. When I use the straw, it actually sounds like a toilet's being flushed. Check it out. Mmm, the candy was good. Now let's move on to the pink toilet. Just follow the same steps as before. I know this toilet's pink, but I think this toilet's closest to joy. She seems really happy. 
Let's try this cola flavor now. Our toilet's filled up again. It's time to clean it up. Mmm, this one's yummy too. Now let's make the blue toilet. I don't think this blue could be sadness. What should we name this one, guys? I want to eat the cider flavor again. This part's seriously the best. Woo! This one was close to overflowing. Well, this was a lot of fun, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Yummy, yummy. For toilet water, this isn't that bad. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we're bringing you Jelly Choco Kanako Mochi. This is one of those instant mochi do-it-yourself candy kits. I'm a big fan of mochi, so hopefully this turns out pretty good. Alright, so here's everything we'll be working with. This is the Kanako, which is roasted soy flour. And we even get some sweet chocolate for our mochi. Here's a cute little fork. We get eight pieces of mochi. They look like mints right now. And it feels like mints too. It's pretty hard. But don't worry, we'll magically transform these soon. Let's pour out the chocolate. And while I do that, if you guys don't know, mochi is a Japanese rice cake. And if you guys have ever eaten rice before, there's no taste to it really. Which is why we need the chocolate and the kanako to add some flavor. This looks like a melted Hershey's candy. Hopefully it tastes like it too. It... It smells more like choco than chocolate though. Now let's pour out the kanako. Oh yeah, wow, that's a kick. You can already smell sesame seeds when you pour this out. So, to make instant mochi, we just need to pour water on top of this. And it should absorb it really quickly to get that mochi texture which should be more gooey. Alright, so if you guys remember from before, these were pretty hard. Now they become pretty squishy, uh, almost like a jelly texture. Also, it's pretty sticky now, so the kanako and chocolate should stick onto the mochi. Let's pick one up and give it a try. First dip in some chocolate, yum! And now some of the kanako. Mmm, actually, I think I need a little more kanako. Alright, here we go! Mmm, it's not bad. I was expecting more of a chewy texture, but this one was kind of slimy. 
I think it's because we just put the water in, but I can't really complain if we're making instant mochi. Let me try making another one to taste again. This time I'll add a little more chocolate. Oh, so the chocolate really didn't taste like Hershey's chocolate. It was more the flavor you taste when you drink a hot chocolate. And we'll get some Kanako. This was actually pretty good. It's sweet, nutty, and if you guys like toasted sesame seeds, you'll definitely love this. Let's try it again. Mm-hmm. For instant mochi, I'd say this is pretty good. Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone! Uh, some Disney toys here. And I hope you guys are hungry, because today I'm doing another Just Like Home playing kit. This one's called Breakfast in Bed. Who doesn't love that? Here's the back of the box. Uh, looks like she made her mom breakfast in bed. How cute! Okay, let's get this box open, because I can't wait to get started. This just slides right out. Ooh, got it. And now we have to take the plastic off. Let's get the bacon off. This set comes with a lot of stuff. Get down here, little eggs. Whew, finally got it. Let's just put everything on this tray so we can take the cardboard off. Nice! Thanks for bearing with me, everyone. Looks like first we have a pitcher. That'll be great for some orange juice. And here's a cup we can put the orange juice in. Ooh, this green cup can be for coffee. But if you don't drink coffee, tea is great. Or even hot cocoa. Yum! A bowl of cereal! What kind of cereal do you guys think this is? I'm gonna go with Cheerios? Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Ah, oh, yum! Bacon's my favorite! And this set comes with two big pieces. And it also comes with two pancakes, which is another favorite of mine. But if you're looking for something a little bit healthier, you can have fruit for breakfast. This orange is perfect. Or even this apple. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Bananas are also great. You can just eat them as is, or even put them in a smoothie. Yum! Two sunny side up eggs. I like my eggs over easy. How do you guys like your eggs? Oh, and we can't forget the milk. Milk is great for breakfast. You can drink it as is or put it in your cereal. Mmm, maple syrup. And here's our cereal box. Hmm, I wonder what this lid is. Could it be for a pitcher? Let's try it. Oh, a perfect fit. And here's our two pieces of toast. You could put butter or jam on it, or even make a sandwich with it. Oh, how cute! This set comes with a napkin. And a small blue plate, and a bigger blue plate. Here are some utensils. We have a spoon, a fork, and a knife. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, so let's get started. I'm going to be using this pan and this spatula from a different set I've done. Let's first make some eggs. We'll just crack it right into the pan. Mmm, it smells pretty good. And I don't know if I can do this, but I'm going to try to flip it back over. One, two, three. Woo, I did it. And here's our first egg. We'll do one more egg. Do you guys think I could flip it again? I guess we won't know until I try. Nice, I flipped it twice. And here are our finished eggs. 
Eggs are great for breakfast because they're a great source of protein. Time for one of my favorite breakfast foods, bacon. We'll also be making this in the pan. Bacon produces a lot of oil, so careful for the splatter. We don't want to burn ourselves. Mmm, it smells pretty good. And here's our bacon. Time to make some pancakes. We'll just give it a little flip. Pancakes cook pretty quick, so we'll take it off the pan right now. They look perfect. And we'll do another one. Yum! And since I don't have a toaster... Let's open up this Disney surprise egg. Of course, we get some more candy. Some Mickey Mouse stickers. And we got this Daisy spinning top. Oh, it doesn't want to stay in the camera. Let's try one more time. There we go. Now let's open up a Kinder Surprise Egg. It looks like we got a Disney toy. It looks like we got a lily pad, and we could spin it around. Now let's open up a Minecraft minifigure. We got a creeper. You never want to run into these. Time to open up some Hello Kitty fashions. We got Nightmare Hello Kitty. But once you squeeze her, she doesn't look scary at all. These are so fun. Let's see what's inside this plain surprise egg. We have so much candy! Here's some plain stickers. It looks like I got another disc shooter. I have way too many of these now. Oops, that didn't sound good. Let's open up a Season 1 Shopkins basket. I still have a few more of these left over.
Hey, it's Toofs! Remember to always brush your teeth! Awesome! We got an ultra rare! This is Delish Donut! Now I really want to eat a donut! Let's see what's inside this littlest pet shop blind bag! Here are all the little pets that we can collect! We got a parrot! It has a patch, so it must be a pirate! Oh nice! We can even twist the head around! And it's a bobblehead! Let's see what's in this My Little Pony surprise egg! Here are all the things that we can collect! Here's a cute My Little Pony sticker! Some heart-shaped candy! And we got this Rainbow Dash picture frame! Nice! Now I'll open up a Marvel Avengers Mashem! Cool, we got Hawkeye! He was pretty cool in the movies! Are you guys One Direction fans? I actually didn't order this, but it came in on accident, but I figured you guys would like it anyway, so I'm unwrapping it. Here's everything that we can collect! If you guys are fans, who's this member? We also get some heart-shaped candies for this one too! Can you guys tell me who this is? Now let's open up a Kinder Surprise Egg! It looks like we got a two-player toy! Cool, we could have a spin-off and see who wins! Let's open up another Shopkins basket! Nice! We got Breadhead! And here's Cheesy B! Time to open up a Disney Cars Egg now! Here are all the items that we can collect! And we get some car shaped candy!
here's a cool sticker. And we got a whistle. Nice. Let's open up another Minecraft minifigure. It's another bad guy. This is Skeleton. Now let's see what littlest pet we get this time. We got this cute bunny. I feel like you would see this bunny in Alice in Wonderland. Time to open up a Super Mario surprise egg. Here are all the cool toys that we can collect. Ooh, I like this sticker a lot. And here's some star-shaped candy. We got a bomb bouncy ball. Time to open up another plain surprise egg. We get more candy. Some more plain stickers. And we got another disc shooter. I think you guys have already seen this enough, so I won't shoot it again. Time for our last egg. It's a Hello Kitty surprise egg. Here are some Hello Kitty stickers. And of course, we get more candy. Cool, we got a heart-shaped notepad. Unwrapping 24 eggs was really fun today. Big, big, big thank you if you guys stuck around for the whole video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you some more mystery minis. This time, I got some inside out ones. Hopefully we can find all 12. Did you guys watch the movie? It's definitely one of my favorite movies this year. Before I open the first one, let's take a closer look at the box. We have Joy and Sadness on one side, Disgust and Bing Bong on the other side. Here are all the 12 characters we can collect. And here's a picture of Anger and Fear. Let's open it up! <laughs> 